What's up? Hey guys, it's Yvonne. In this video, I want to talk about Microsoft Ads and what you can do when you have an ad disapproved for destination mismatch. So let's get right into it. I have my ad here, which was luckily disapproved, so I could show you what you can do. Uh, it's a keto diet uh, ad, and as you can see here, if I click on these little three dots here for delivery details, it says your ad has been disapproved because it violates our policies because the domain does not match the landing page URL. Now, if you followed all my other videos on how to uh, direct link or just promote on Bing, uh, you will know that this is the correct way to do it. But occasionally you will have your ads disapproved. Uh, and there is a little trick you can do to just get that out of the way. So just to show you that my uh, landing page URL and my tracking template link do match, I'm just going to take this URL and I'm going to open it in a new window. And as you can see here, right, remember this URL. And then what we're going to do is we're going to take this URL and then paste it here. And as you can see here, it's the exact same page. So why was the ad disapproved? I have no idea, but it is a system issue, okay? So it's not like a Microsoft Ads rep came in here, looked at the ad and said, okay, this doesn't match. This is a system issue. So the way you counter this is you simply click on your ad, and if you have a, a dot at the end of your ad, you just remove it. If you, have a, a, if you don't have a dot, you just add a dot. Simple things like these tiny, tiny tweaks just make the ad go into review again. That's what you do make the ad go into review. This is a system issue. Let the system re-review it. Once you do that, it should go again. Uh, it, sh it should go away and it shouldn't bother you anymore. So for this ad, I did not have a period, as you can see here. Now I'm going to do is I'm going to add a period. I'm going to click save and that's it. The ad is now pending review and it will soon get out of that pending review because the system will re-review it and everything will be fine. Okay. Um, so generally speaking, this is how I've been handling all my disapproved ads for these reasons. Um, and once I fix it once, it usually doesn't come back again. Now, if for some reason you do have an issue where um, it's recurring and it keeps doing that and you followed all my steps to make sure that everything is correct, I'll have a link up above for how to do that. Then you might want to contact support and have them look at it. Um, just the first time this happens make sure you do this because otherwise it takes them quite a long time for the support to review it and to manually approve it and uh, another thing is sometimes i've had it on occasion where my ad was fine everything was good but it was disapproved for this landing page mismatch and when i would contact support they would give me an entirely different reason for why it was disapproved and i had to completely redo my uh, landing page. So this is the quick and easy fix. This is going to take way faster than waiting for a rep to do it. It's a system issue. Let the system rehandle it. Um, that's how I look at it in this way. Um, so that's about it. That's how you handle a destination mismatch disapproval on your ad in Microsoft Ads. If you have any other questions, let me know. I hope you did find this video useful and valuable. Uh, if you have any other questions, like I said, uh, let me know down below. I try to be as responsive as I can. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I cover a lot of different online marketing tools, tips, tricks, reviews, you name it. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video.